Reverse phone search. There are a ton of scams out there. Who called me? I have an unknown phone number and I'm trapped. I need help. There's a maze of websites. Which one is safe? Be careful of scam sites. Many websites on the internet tell you they have the information only to try and sell you a monthly membership when all you want is the name, or maybe the name and address, of a person who called you. Break away. Recognize the scams. Many scam sites have a similar flow. You enter your phone number, then they lead you on and let you think they have the information you're looking for. Maybe even show you something that says name available or similar baiting language. Proceed with caution. After you enter your phone number, animated graphics start to whiz. You feel like something's happening. Then blam up. They show you the carrier or city and state and tell you more information is available. If you sign up for a trial or a membership, don't take the bait. Warning, warning, danger Will Robinson, danger. See, something seems fishy. You've seen all this before. All we want is the name of the person that has this phone number. I don't want a trial membership. I don't want to have to cancel within seven days. I don't want it, but it's so tempting. I need to know if they have the information. They say it's available, but it probably isn't. Most of us know these websites are using psychology sales tactics, but yet many people still fall for these scams. Then they have to try to get a full refund or cancel. Sometimes it's just not worth the effort. Many people don't take the time to find out if the site is legitimate. They fall prey and then convince themselves they paid to learn a lesson. These websites keep on perpetuating as there are millions of people who fall for these sales scams every day. There is a safer way. Before making a purchase, check for reviews or check for scams. Google the name of the website you're using and then the word scam or review after it. Read what other people are saying about their service. Are there any complaints? Check out the ripoff report. How long have they been in business? Do a domain age. Is there a phone number, an address on their website? Do they answer questions by phone or email quickly? Don't be hasty. It's your money. Better to spend a few minutes before you purchase than have a hassle later on. But who do you trust? You can usually trust websites that have good reviews, a privacy policy, a posted one, a toll-free phone number posted clearly on the website, as well as a posted way to contact customer support, including the hours of operation. Look for a contact tab on the menu or in the footer of the site. Most legitimate sites may even have their phone number on every page, often at the top or the bottom. Free or paid results. Some info should be free. A good way to test if a website is a scam or legitimate is to enter a phone number for someone you know that has a published number or a local or well-known business. You can even try the website's own phone number. The phone number is listed. A reverse phone lookup of this number below should give you free results anywhere. If it doesn't, we think the site is a scam. Enter 760-454-7301 into the web form of the site you're using. If you don't get results, I wouldn't proceed. In summary, how to be sure you found a trusted website? Well, they should give you free access to published white pages. They should give you free yellow page information. No scams or hidden agendas. Upfront premium data pricing. No membership required. Toll-free support. Trusted by industry professionals. They should have posted hours, solid reviews, and business longevity. And guess what? We just happen to know of such a company. Searchbug www.searchbug.com